Oh, it's you. You're not supposed to be here. James, get up. We're late. Why do I have to get so drunk on a Sunday night? Do you remember that part last night when uh, Amy got on the table and started to? That's my sister. I do not need to be reminded. Where's all the food? <laughs> Come on, let's go. Guys, we're going to be late. Should we get to drive after you stunt last night, Amy? Oh, hi, Matt. You ain't. Not getting bust today. Nope. Hi. I saw him as I drove past the shops and picked him up. Oh, okay. So what's the rush anyway? Some kind of emergency meeting.
What do you think this emergency meeting's about? I don't know, but it can't be that important. Right, go on ahead, guys. I'm going to pad my nose. No, Dr. Neven. LHC is the most important experiment of our time. I will not to that unfounded theory. Unfounded? Director, my results show that. Inconclusive. Them. Your results are inconclusive at best. No, you'll have plenty of time for measurements when you are down in the tunnel tonight. Director, we have to stop the LHC until we assess the danger. No, Dr. Neven. Once we have fixed this problem, the LHC will run again as usual. Finding the Higgs is the highest priority. Why is Dr. Niven going into the tunnels? What do you think the Director General said? Maybe they made a black hole. <laughs> hey. hey! So did you recover from last night? Yeah, you too? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, aren't you meant to be on your way to Barcelona by now? I might have missed my flight. Oh no! <laughs> Good morning. I am Professor Vyshinsky, Director General of CERN. This meeting has been called because last night there was an emergency beam dump. Here we see a monopole magnet in LHC sector 7G. Beam sensors have detected that an unknown event caused this magnet to quench and triggering an uncontrolled shutdown. If this happens again, the results could be catastrophic. Due to the special circumstances, Dr. Neven is taking a team into the LHC tunnel to investigate the cause and see what damage there is. The LHC will be in shutdown at least until the end of the week. Since Dr. Neven will not be available, we will need four volunteers to be on shift in the control room. Well done. Okay. You four. I'm going to be at a conference in Barcelona. Uh, very well. Uh, you, you then. Uh, I have an analysis note due this week, so I'm not going to have time to do this. The collider will be shut down. You can work in the control room. A report to the control room at 9 p.m. That is all, everybody. Sucks to be there. Here you go. Thanks. They don't look like proton decay matrices. <sighs> no. Dr. Niven's got me working on this Higgs bioentanglement simulation. Some company gave a lot of money to CERN and I get stuck working on it. I got so much work to do. Listen, are you okay after last night? Why? You and Matt. I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, you jealous? Oh, sorry. Listen, I'd better go. I got a lot of work to do. Oh, 
I'm so tired. I can't even think about work right now. I hope he doesn't expect me to remember anything. Ah, Lisa. Did you finish your talk? Yeah, just in time. I had every confidence in you. Did you get a chance to look at my simulation? Ah, yes. The problem with the supersymmetric parameter lattice. I think I found a way to express it differently. I didn't implement it in my analysis code yet, but you might like to try it. It looks more complex though. I don't know if it'll work on my laptop. Well, we'll deal with that later if we need. Okay, thanks. Anyway, I have to prepare my team for going into the tunnels and look over Lisa's talk, so I'll talk to you later. And Lisa, don't miss the plane again. I won't. Hey, guys, wait. I'm waiting for someone. Who? Just someone. Okay, well, we're gonna be late, so... Hi. Hey. Everyone, this is my girlfriend, Kate. Kate. This is Matt and Connor. Hi. And my sister Amy. Hi. Nice to finally meet you. Finally? I didn't tell you. Mom let it slip. I was waiting for you to tell me. It's, it's nice to finally meet you as well. Are you coming with us? I think so. Yeah. Okay. Should we go? So, um, why have you thrown your evening away to go and shift? James was going to come meet me for dinner, but then he told me you guys had to, uh... Oh, sorry. It's okay, don't worry. And how did James manage to convince you that vending machine food is going to be an acceptable substitute? Shift can sometimes be boring. Are you going to be okay? I told her. I, I insisted. She's with me. So are you guys physicists like James? Yeah, but he works on the accelerator. The rest of us analyze the data. Yeah, he's an engineer and we're real physicists. <sighs> so what do you do? I'm a trained nurse. I hope you're not lost freight rate. It's a long way down. Guys, I thought of a joke. Oh, another one. So a chimpanzee in a slot goes down. And then the chimpanzee's like, uh, uh, starfish, starfish! <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to just clock our orange? I borrowed it from Amy. Yep, sure. It's a pretty deep film for a lowly engineer like yourself. <laughs>
so the accelerator boosts the beams of protons to almost the speed of light, and then we collide them here, and then we detect what's made in the collision. I got it working. Got what working? A uh, Higgs simulation. Uh, what simulation? My Higgs radiation simulation. The God particle? It's a particle that we're trying to make in the collider. I'm meant to be investigating how it acts on living tissue, but uh, my program just crashes every single time that it starts to look bad. So what? You think Higgs radiation is dangerous? <sighs> I don't know, I'd know if I could get it to finish. They wouldn't run the LAC if they thought it was a danger. It must be a glitch or something. Have you tried on the central computer system? Except she doesn't have access to the mainframe. Are you not allowed to use it? Well, not exactly. There we go. Nice. Nice one, Amy. It wasn't me. It's not you. The, the LHC is ramping. Ramping, ramping? The beams are firing. The, the tube's still down there! Shut it off! What the fuck? The phones are down! What, what's going on? The LEC's turned on. The radiation levels will be killing everyone who's down there. People are dying! No one is dying! Shut up, Matt! James, what can we do? I don't know. The overrides aren't working. I, I haven't got any signal. We're 100 metres underground. What do you expect? <laughs> the radiation levels are spiking. The shielding's not in place when the maintenance tunnels are open. Well, why the fuck not? This shouldn't be able to happen. <sighs> Shit. We've got less than two minutes and we're fried. We need to get out. <laughs> James, calm down, I think. How do we get out? We're going to the service tunnels. The tunnels? Are you mental? The LAC Master Power is down there. It's shielded, we can shut it off. This is insane. Right, we'll go down and shut it off. Then we'll work out what to do there. No, you can't be- Come on!
So that's it. The world's largest machine is an on-off switch. What is your problem? Look, this is just a relay with six of them. If one of them trips, the others go off automatically. I hope somebody noticed that. There's no one around to notice it. No one will be in until tomorrow. We need to find an elevator to get back to the surface. Yeah, if uh, James knows where they are. But if we follow the tunnels, we'll get out. What about the people down there? They could still be alive, couldn't they? Even if they have, there's nothing we can do for them. The best we can do is get out and try and get help. But if the radiation did that to them, then... No, we're safe now the machine's off. It's just the ring itself that's radioactive. We're safe here. Oh my god, all those people. How could this happen? It couldn't have happened. You can't turn the machine on when there are people down there. There are interlock systems everywhere. Well, someone's fucked up, and it wasn't me. Yeah, and it wasn't us. This couldn't happen from the control room. No one's got access to do that, except... Except maybe Dr Niven, but he was down there. The sooner we get out of here, the sooner we can sort it out. Steam valve or something, right? Probably. How much further is it? It's not far. Great. Just when I was starting to get freaked out. Look, I'm sorry, I thought that... Do you know where we're going, or don't you? Matt! I can't be the only person that heard that scream. We're running around down here. I mean, where the fuck are we going? Matt, calm down. If you know where to go, let's hear it. If not, shut up. James, do you know where we can go? I think if we go back and left and follow the ring around, we can find our way from there.
All those people, James, you saw what they did. They'll just fucking stand there. What the fuck just happened? They look like the technician team that were down here. Why would they do that to us? Did you see their faces? Radiation burns, yeah. They shouldn't even be alive. Where are you going? The gas won't stop them forever. Find a way out. Come on, let's go. What if there's more of them? Yeah. His main neck has a gun. I think he's been dead a while. What's the security guard doing down here anyway? It's been sabotaged. Someone did this on purpose. Let me go. James, stop!
points, man. Right. What else was I gonna do? If they're all like that, we're screwed. There were like, what, 30 people in this section? We'll find a way out. James, which way? I thought there was an exit back in the dead end. The next one's about a three hour walk away, it's at point 17. And that's if we don't get lost. So we know we're safe, we can stop on the way. We need to let someone know we're down here. There's a mainframe computer room about halfway around. We can send a message from there. Which way now? We have to go that way. Jesus, what does it take to kill one of these things? They're people, Matt! No person could survive this! Are you hurt? It's my arm.
Are you all right? Yeah. You too. Yeah, I'll be fine. Stock set to my username. Connor, can you hack this? Not now, Matt. Give him a minute. But the quicker we get through to the server, the sooner we Give him a rest, Matt! How many excuses is he going to be to us if he's concussed? Uh, same place as last time. Same place as what? Crap school climbing. I had to put a metal plate in my head. You never told me about that. Because when I went home for a few weeks, after Prague. Oh. I didn't mean it like that. Yeah, just give me a minute. And I'll see what I can do with the terminal. Is there anything up there? The door is secure, there's no one about. I think we're safe for now. Alright, we'll stay here for a bit. I'll try and get through the firewall, see if I can get any help. How's your arm? Don't worry about me. The bleeding stopped. Keep an eye on them stairs. We need to be looking for Kate. James. I know what you're trying to say, but you're wrong. Amy, come here. You go through. 
Uh, no, but he says Amy's bio sim just finished. Oh. So? So I was right about Higgs radiation. Killed them all. Killed who? They're not dead. Yes, they are. It's killed everything except the brainstem. There's nothing left of them. <gasps> the radiation damage might stop it after a while, but for now they're just animals. You must have messed up with something, Mr. Semicolon. The, the Higgs wouldn't do that. It doesn't even look like my simulation. It looks more like Dr. Nimmons. The doctor never knew. They still came down here. No, he says it's only just completed. He's been trying to run it for weeks and it always failed. Until now. So they've been dead since the beam came on. I can't get help, but if I can get a map of the tunnels, can you find a way out? I'll try. Find the way? Why don't you ever know? I haven't been to this area before. Okay then, how long will it take this time? Map, enough. Fuck you, Connor! Why have I been listening to you? Your fault we're on shift, your fault we're down here in the first fucking place. Leave him alone! Are concerned about his feelings now, are we? Don't. What? Everyone else has figured it out, James. We fucked last night. Fuck you, Matt. I was drunk. I'm not that drunk. You took advantage of my sister. Advan- <laughs> Whatever. At least I get laid. Beating her 5k. You fuck! I'm going to find Kate. James, she's dead. I have to go. No, stop it, James. Come back. I need you. Come back. I can't let him do this alone. Help. No, stay here. You have to find help. Do you know where you're going? I think there's a shortcut up here. I... I just... Thanks for coming. Look, Matt. Forget about that. Fine. Matt, we need to stick together to get out of here. Don't I worry said about it. Fine.
okay? What's wrong? Please don't look. Please don't look. Let's go. Is he okay? I think his wound's infected. I'll be okay. Did you call for help? No, uh, I couldn't get through the firewall, but I got a map for this area. All right. Where'd you get that? We found a body in the tunnels. I must have shot that guard. But I saw him with the Director General earlier. Listen, there's something else. So after you guys left, all the SIM data got deleted from the system? There's only one person with the authority to do that. What if he's trying to stop people from finding out? That could be why we can't call for help. Are there any backups anywhere? Doctor Niven keeps a record of everything he does. It could be enough if we can get to his office. If he knows we're down here. We'll get out. Hey, Joyce. I think I found something. Okay, so we start here, and then we go over to here. The service lifts are down, so I have to take the stairs. There's a crawl space here, and then we come to here, and then we get out here. Is there any way we can come out nearer to Dr. Nevin's office? Why? The simulation data logs got deleted. We have to go and find records. I don't think we can get through. There are safety doors in the way. James? James? James! Is he okay? I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with him. He's sleeping for now, but maybe we could let him rest for a bit? Yeah. No. I think we should get moving as soon as we can. If it doesn't rest, we'll have to carry him. 
We can't wait here forever. And if he can't look after himself... Don't you dare, you selfish piece of shit! If you want to go, just go on your own! No one's going anywhere. We'll rest for a bit. Then we'll leave. <laughs> Les gens sont vraiment des incompétents. Il y en a marre d'avoir des résultats aussi faux tous les jours, tous les jours. Je dois des moyennes. Franchement, mais regardez ça. Incroyable, non Parce que bah, ce qui tient euh, tous les moteurs électriques. Ouais. Mister, Mister, please, it's not a safe area. Come over, we call an ambulance. Appelle une ambulance.
time. I don't have long. Everything's fucked. Everyone's dead. The director general killed them all. Pick up the fucking phone. Please listen, I'm gonna email you the data. You're the only one who can understand it. Move away from the computer. You did this. You killed them all. I didn't know this would happen. But I had to do it. Doctor Niven knew the Higgs was dangerous. But I couldn't let that stop me. My research is too important. I had to. And I can't let you tell anyone.